Having trouble finding that special soulmate? Oh, I know. Are you ready to find love? So what do you think your ideal mate is? This I can solve for you. Check out Secrets of Birthdays, The Love and Lust Report at secretsofbirthdays.com. Hello Pisces and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, Sonny and incredibly passionate about career today, we come into the full moon apex and the lunar eclipse in Sagittarius. We started talking about yesterday, we've been feeling these pressures probably as soon as or early as last Saturday. But it all comes to a head today, which is a tug of war between your, imagine, your, your passion about career and legacy and what you need to take care of yourself. In essence, it's time to adopt a new way of thinking when it comes to self-nurturing, one that is going to help you move to the career or take the control of your life that you need. What the universe is suggesting today for Pisces is, if career is off course, it's because your home is not grounded, not settled. Now, Venus is also trining Saturn, which means as you begin to create new self-nurturing energy, new self-care ritual, you will be simultaneously relaxing and freeing up to change some of your boundaries, which is what Saturn Direct this week also means. Time for Pisces to move forward with new boundaries. Well, according to the astrology, some of the boundary hang-up was the wrong attitude about self-nurturing. In other words, you don't have to have so many walls up if you know you can take care of yourself. And don't forget, we got Full Moon Goddess live again today. She's going to help you through the eclipse. Carolyn Nagel's got a song for you to sing to yourself if it's really hitting hard. And Skip Jennings is here today with the Urban Mystic. He'll be doing his question and answer episode, which we'll be applying to the entire shift. So don't miss Carolyn and Skip. They're here to help. All right, that's all I got for today, Pisces. I'll see you tomorrow when all the dust settles. Until then, live, love, be. So